Hi friends, so the first thing I want to teach you in biblical journaling is how to use the online lexicon called Bible Hub and this is going to help you um, learn the words and phrases in the scriptures in their original language. So this is going to be a tutorial on how to do that. So the two is biblehub.com um, and it'll look like this. So first thing you want to do is come over here to parallel and then it's going to pull up um, this page and then you're going to choose a scripture up here. So say we wanted to do um, John. John 1.1 1, 1, we would come down here, go to John, um, and then if you wanted something other than 1.1 1, 1, you would come in here and mess with that. Oops, it's still in Genesis. Come on. There we go. All right, so if you wanted something other than John 1.1, 1, 1, you would go in here and mess around with that. All right, and then the second place you're going to go is to the Greek. All right, so we've got in the beginning was the word, and the word was, let me exit that, and the word was with God, and the word was God. Um, and then so you can go in here and um, see the original language. I love this. Look at word is logos which means divine expression. Um, so that is how you use that part. And if you want a deeper understanding of the word, then you would come here to the Strong's Concordance. Um, for word, it's 3056. Press that. And then um, from here, this will show you the different areas that the word is used throughout the scriptures. Um but you can come up here to Strong's and get a deeper uh, understanding of the word. Okay, so you can see that it just expounds upon the word all the more. And um, that is the gist of it. Um, on the home screen though, friends, let's see. Um, you can also, if you're looking for cross-references, you can do that as well. So right here, you go to cross-reference. You can find commentaries, um, the context. So that's all pretty exciting. Um, so that's about it. Thank you so much for uh, listening. I hope that this will help you get started on your word study portion of your journaling and your Bible study. God bless.